First, start with your vegetables. You're gonna have uh, use a half of a uh, green bell pepper, half of a red bell pepper, about a quarter of a red onion, and about one or half of a jalapeno, just depending on the heat. And then, of course, you want to use some vegetable oil. Get some chili powder and some cumin. Then get a pound of hamburger, any type. It's not a problem. And of course, get some Mexican chorizo in there as well. Now you want to go ahead and olive oil your pan up. Of course, the pan is preheated. After that's done, go ahead and dump in your vegetables. Everything goes in at once. And what you just want to do is you just want to cook it so it just slowly, slowly sweats. Move it around. Shouldn't take too long. A few minutes here, maybe six, seven. All right, now you've got them all sweated out. Vegetables look great. What you want to go ahead and do now is take them and put them onto a plate or a bowl for later. All right, so now we're gonna put the meat in the same pan. This is the beef. And what we're gonna do is just start chopping it up so it doesn't cook like a hamburger, but instead cooks up in small pieces of beef. Once you've done that, go ahead and add your two uh, chorizo links. Once those have been added, go ahead and start chopping all that together as well. There you go, everything starts to cook together, looking good. Now that everything's cooking together, you want to go ahead and re-add your uh, sweat vegetable mix. And of course, add a little cumin, maybe just like a teaspoon. And about a tablespoon of uh, chili powder, a little pepper, some salt. Mix everything together. Everything's coming together. Excellent. This is what it looks like. Nice, beautiful, red, and tasty. It's as simple as that. Go ahead and fill your empanada shells and voila. Look how beautiful that is. Alright guys, thanks for watching and please don't forget to like and subscribe.